Extended final. Hey, go, dude. We're gonna be finishing up the 2122 extended series case. Got the final three boxes here. We need some key things from these final three boxes. So there's that. But before we get into today's video, this is sponsored by Mars Trading. Looking for a sealed box of yourself? Check out MarsTrading.com. Featuring all the new boxes, ranging from hockey to TCGs. Be sure to check out Mars Breaks. Mars Trading's new group break site, which Mars Trading goes live on whatnot on Wednesdays and Saturdays. Be sure to check out the upcoming breaks, and break results will be shown on Mars Trading's YouTube page. So be sure to check out Mars Breaks. Also, be sure to check out the app, a useful and handy way to shop. Featuring the collections tab, which shows the in stock hockey boxes and pre orders, and much more. Also, be sure to check out Sezzle. Why not pay later? Make purchasing those big ticket items Easy. Thank you, Marsh Ring, for sponsoring today's video. All the links in the descriptions can do today's video. All right, final three boxes of the case. I will do a recap of the case after we open boxes 10, 11, 12 of the case here. Still need a couple of canvas young guns. Still need a French young gun. Still need a Moscow canvas. I mean, heck, these are $40 boxes, but we haven't pulled a card worth more than $20 in here, so I'm hoping we can do that here and get at least one solid pull. So, yeah, let's get into it. 21 to extend. I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty messed up right now. Running on very little sleep. Definitely not the first time I've recorded. Running on minimal to no sleep. You can't always yell like a bugged out lunatic at 4 a.m., so you gotta wait till it's an acceptable hour. So, yeah, let's get into extend it here. Still need some things from this case. Hopefully get that cider canvas in here. But, oh, trilogy. So these seem to fall like one in three boxes. We got level three, Michael Bunting, 299. That was probably decent when this stuff came out. But, autograph, level three, rookie premieres. I'm Bunting at 299, so, okay. Also, we do need five young guns for the set. Including JJ Paterka. I haven't pulled a JJ Paterka yet. But, here we go. Oh, baby Zetterlin. Young gun, so, half decent one there. Already pulled Zetterlin, so there's that. Okay, pack number three, holographic gold, Anton Lundell. Next up, there's Mc... David and Hot Colson, Rookie Jam, Single Diamond. Next pack, we have one of these. $29.99 It's a Mark Shifley. Finite to $29.99. Still no exclusives. Still waiting on that Upper Deck exclusives. Hasn't come yet, but got a canvas. Black Prize, okay. Then we have, oh, one of these, Sid. Okay. UD3 of Crosby there. That's the 1,000. 559, 1,000. There's our other numbered card for this box, okay. I mean, that's three numbered cards already from this box. So, uh, we got Dazzlers here. Bo Horvat. Well, these are like four per case for the Dazzlers Blue. And and then we have Young Guns, Alex Steves, second Steves of this case, case. Maybe get a long shot auto here in the final few boxes. There's a McDavid 607. I mean, I have my doubts. I'm kind of down we even get an exclusive in this case, but we got Sachenko, Young Gun. Another one I already have, okay. Another one already pulled thus far. Then we got Prunovic, another one already pulled. So getting the same ones would be nice to complete a set from getting a case. It feels like it's been a while since I've done that. Uh, but we got Camper Canvas, nice canvas there in Madison Square Garden. And then we have another Young Guns. It is Adam Beckman, another one I already got, but there's Beckman, okay. And then we have Shiny Curran here. It's 99 of Mason McTavish, which these don't go for a whole lot whatsoever, so. I I mean, a lot of the inserts in here don't go for too much, so. But we yeah, Shane got the spare, 607. Next pack, we got a canvas, Corey Perry. Still waiting on a mascot canvas, but there's Corey Perry, okay. See if he gets a contract. And then we have, what is this pack here, French? Uh, yeah, Adam Fox, French variation. There's one of our Frenches, okay. Still expecting a French Young Guns in here, they're one in 120. And then we have, oh, Sid, 607. That would have been second year for Sid in 0607, okay. Then we got holographic Jeannot and Black Diamond, Kale McCarr, Double Diamond. So yeah, I'm kind of hoping to get a card that's worth more than 20 bucks in this case. That's now the target as we have a canvas Young Guns. Is it Sokoloff again? No, it's Seth Jarvis. I'll take that. That's not too bad. Seth Jarvis, canvas Young Guns. So there's one of the better ones to get in the canvas Young Guns. So I believe that's regular canvas number five in this case. We did get a black also, but there's a Jarvis canvas. Nice. I don't think that's a $20 card, but still, uh, we got Alnafeld Young Guns. Okay, Hugo Alnafeld. And Fall pack for box 10. Not a bad box by any means. We got three numbered cards. That Jarvis is nice, but uh, what's in here? Oh, here we go. Retro Young Guns. Seems to end every box, but there you go. Cold Perfetti. There you go. Cold Perfetti. Huh. Alright, let's move on to box 11 of the case. Second last box. Fairly underwhelming to this point. I guess my new target is just getting an exclusives. I don't think I've never not gotten an exclusives from any of my cases of any years of flagship. I've always at least gotten one, but I highly doubt it's gonna happen for 23 24 series 2. But Adam Fox, 607. I don't know, who knows? But uh, what do we get here? Another 607, Seth Jones. And then we have a Young Guns. It is Holtz, okay? Second Holtz Young Guns. That's a decent one there, okay? One of the headliners for Extended. And another Young Guns, Sokolov, okay? There's Igor Sokolov. Still missing five for the set. There's the Brinket, Holographics. Then we have the Black Diamond. Connor McDavid, Quad Diamond. Here we go, Quad for McDavid. Still no number card yet from this box. We got a French Young Guns right here. 
here or oh, reflection full Caulfield. Just the base reflections there. Got a couple of numbered cards of these from the case. So those are some of the nicer numbered cards in here. They are fairly high numbered though. There are lower numbered ones, but they're the Krauss canvas. Okay. Oh, here we go. Speaking of, we got one right. Oh, it's Mitch Marner. There you go. The reflections. It's a red Mitch Marner. That's 54 of 500 from Marner there. So it's an all right pull. High numbered, but nice looking card nonetheless. So there's Marner. Then we have holographic Cole Cylinder. Okay. Well, what do we got here? Black Diamond Kucherov. Okay. Oh, Canvas is a mascot. Nope. Tom Wilson. I'll put a Canvas cape. This product is definitely largely unspectacular. I mean, it's worth that 40 bucks. I don't know about anything more than that, but there's Shane Pinto who recently signed. He served his suspension, but that's a $29.99 Definite cape. They must have produced a bunch of this. Oh, we got a Young Guns here. Torpchenko. There's Alexei Torpchenko. Another one that's already been pulled from this case. Uh, oh, Black Canvas. Okay. Well, I don't think that's Cider. Pretty sure that's not Cider, but it might be. It's not. It's Cole Schwint. Okay, well, there you go. Second black and white canvas of the case. Cole Schwint. Well, it's not black and white. It's just black for 21-22, but there's Schwint. Definitely not the best name there. He's in the Calgary organization, but there's Cole Schwint. Okay, I mean, we're getting a lot of stuff. All of this stuff is not overly substantial there. JJ Moser, Young Guns. There's Moser. That's one of the better names there, I would say, in terms of quality NHL players, but, oh, we have another Young Guns. It is Gabriel Forche. Young Guns case. Okay, so, getting a little worried here that I'm not going to be able to complete the set. Uh, we have another Young Guns. It's Akira Schmid, which I already pulled. So, yeah, getting really worried here. Missing Paterk. Uh, well, Justin Barron, Canvas Young Guns there. So, there you go. Justin Barron, Canvas Young Guns. Not a bad one whatsoever. He's on the Habs now. Likely means we don't get a cider here, though. I mean, we're getting no shortage of bulk Young Guns in here. We're getting overwhelming amount of, like, $1 to $5 cards in here. So, oh, we got a Canvas in here. It is Anthony Duclair scoring on Allmark. Okay. Plenty of nice Canvases. That's probably the standard of this product is the Canvases. Like, the random, really good ones that are kind of questionable. But, yeah. Oh, we got a Lucas Raymond, 99 2000. Three more packs of Box 11. Uh, we got a French in here. No, we got Mark Stone. Okay, where's that 607 Young Gun? Oh, it's right here. Okay, well, it is Jane Pinto. 607 Young Guns. For Pinto, there's 25 of these in the set, so we have 12 or 25 out of this. And the final pack. Largely underwhelming to this point. Uh, oh, we got a Young Guns here. Oh, there's a French. Adam Beckman. French Young Guns there, so that's largely okay there, but there's Beckman. I mean, I'm not sure what I'm expecting, to be honest, but here's the final box of the case. We still need a mascot. Come on, we need that right there, so let's open up the final box. Now, all right, final box, box 12. Hopefully there's something semi-interesting in the final box here. Well, we got a Young Guns. Hey, there he is. Okay, well, JJ Paterka. Maybe we can finish this set here in the final box. Young Guns, so this might be the top one in terms of value, which is understandable. Paterka, highly skilled German there. He's definitely emerged as a full-time top six this year and has potential to be much more than that, so there's Paterka. Okay, I'm kind of hoping for a surprise in here, though. We got Holographics Holtz. Uh, hoping for a pleasant surprise. May or may not come here. Sean Dursey, there you go. Another one I need. Young Guns, so on the Coyotes now, decent defenseman. He became expendable to the Kings because the Kings have guys like Spence and Clark in their system. So there's John Dursey. Bjorkvist is another one we need. There's McTash, Double Diamond, K. Uh, what else here? Dazzlers, Barkoff, Dazzlers, Blue, K. Uh, we got Canvas, Hala. Still hoping to get another mascot, Canvas. Okay. We got Pot Colson, 9 2000. And we have a Canvas. It's not a mascot, it is. Connor Brown. Introductions for the Sens there. He's on Edmonton now, but there's Brown. Okay, do we got another Young Guns we need? Nope. There's a Rupe Hint, 607. And then we have another Young Guns. It is Harvey Pennard. So, I already have that one. There's Raphael Harvey Pennard. Decent one there. No doubt we at least got 50% from this case. Definitely average at least $20 per box. But, ooh, we got a printing plate. There's a decent surprise there. Don't think it's a Young Guns, though. Uh. Uh, it's not a Young Guns. Or is it? No, Sean Monahan. Or Jacob Marks. I'm pretty sure it's Monahan, though. Canvas printing plates, so. Sean Monahan, canvas printing plate, 101 yellow printing plate, so. There you go. That might be one of our best pulls of the case. Like a $10 printing plate, so. There you go, Monahan. Okay, well, let's continue on here. Finish off the case. Barzell, holographics. I mean, it's cool to get a printing plate, but it's largely underwhelming. We got Swayman, triple diamond rookie gems. <laughs> okay, well, oh, there you go. Chance. <laughs> no gritty. But we got Chance, so I'll take it. Mascot canvas. These are cool. No gritty, but I'll take chance. Okay, well, another young.
young as it is. Bjorkfist there. Okay, well, need Bjorkfist, so just down to two needing for the set. There's Casper Bjorkfist playing the Finnish League. Past couple seasons, but yeah, not a great one there. Next pack up here, another young as it is. Brett Lease. There we go, another one I need. So, looks like we're probably gonna get the set. There go, there's Leeson. Big forward for the Ducks now. Got some skill, but largely a bottom six guy there. There's that. Next up here is this. So oh, it's a retro young guns. It is Alex Newhook, 607 young guns. There you go, there's Alex Newhook. Okay. Will we get an exclusive? Down to like seven packs here. So uh, is there an exclusive in here? Terra Vinan, 607. If not, that'll mean there's a lot of this produced. And I suspect that series two, 23, 24 is gonna Oh, hey, there you go. Martin Jones on the Philadelphia Flyers. As I was saying. Got one there, so that's 86 of 100 for Martin Jones. So there you go. Upper deck exclusives. There's Jones' brief stop with Philly. We're going to Seattle, so now he's on the Maple Leafs, but there's Martin Jones. Got an exclusive. Definitely take that there. Finally. Okay, well, we got Alex Ovech. Pretty sure I have a parallel version of this, but 2584 of 2999 for Ovi there. The finite. Yeah, final four packs of the case. We just need one young guns for the set, I'm pretty sure. I forget who it is. It's Janssen Fjallby. There you go. Axel Janssen Fjallby. Young guns. So hold this clear cut. There's his base that completes the set for extended series, which is nice. Getting the set. Got an exclusive there. Definitely worth $40 a box. I have to say that. Sadly, if it was like 70 or 80, it definitely wouldn't be worth that. But we got Kadri Canvas Cake. Second last pack of the case. Oh, what's this? Just Oh, it's another French. Okay, well, maybe uh, Harvey Pennard because he's on the Habs and he's French King. 3 to one Bim! Mason Shaw. Dang it. French Young Guns. So, these are 1 in 120. So, you have a chance of getting 3. Did get 3. So, get another Minnesota Wild French Young Guns. So, we got plenty of Young Guns in here. And we'll finish off the final pack here. Getting plenty of value here. But, we finish off with 607. Demon Stamp goes. Okay. There, so guys, there's a case of 21-22 Extended Series. Let's do a recap. All right, case recap. I'll start here with the basic Young Guns. Did, in fact, get the 50 young gun set there's two holt two release and two fortier pizzetta protus so some guys i want to get double of i didn't which is unfortunate like a noonan i hope i would have got a double of him paterka only got one paterka which is a little bit disappointing there what else we got here we got two akira schmids there only one turcot uh, only one solder bloom what else do we have here two salos two alnafelts two zetterlins only one jack jury there uh, what else we got two toropchenkos uh, two harvey pinards which is too bad there. Two Alex Steves. Two Dan Four. Only one Seth Jarvis. So only one Tarasov. Two Dawes, which is nice. But yeah, did get the set there. Which is nice to get a set after opening a case. So there's a basic Young Gun set. We got the 99 2000, which are one per box. These really don't go for a whole lot. But we got 12 total there of these. So there's that. Team with the Retro Theme. We got the Holographics. We got five of the ones that say NHL there. And then we got a bunch of rookies there. Nothing overly special there. Even like the golds here don't add a whole lot of value, but we got five of them. The black diamond rookie gems, kind of a weird choice that they're in there. Plenty of single diamonds there. Got some double diamond vets, triple diamond, quad McDavid. And there's all the rookie gems there. I believe we only got one quad diamond rookie gems. It is. Yeah, Lucas Raymond. Okay. And then the reflections, these are quite nice. Got Caulfield, Byfield, and then two other base there. And then we got three numbered. Two of them, the 500, the Reds, of McKinnon and Marner. And got one Patrick Kane. So good names there. The Kane's a 300. So those are nice. And then we got 12 of these finites at $29.99. These are largely unspectacular there. We did get a couple of lower number ones, but they're the $29.99. Got the OV to $29.99 and the OV to $7.99. Also got a Ranton at $7.99. So there's those finites. Trilogies landed one in three boxes. Got four of them. Got Kachev level one, student each level one, Porche level two, and a bunting level three. So no autograph from trilogy. Got four trilogy rookies there, so there's that. We got three UD3 cards. These are to a thousand. Unless it's a gold to hundred, but got Matthews and Crosby, so two good names there. And then we got a Cairo Gold to 100, so there's those UD3 Rocket cards there. I don't think they're called, but there's that. We only got one of these future impacts of Lucas Raymond, another UD3 card there. That one's to 1,000 as well for Raymond, so. And then we got a Records Collection. These are one 240 packs of Bobby Orr. Not numbered, but still quite nice. Probably one of the best pulls of the case right here. A specialist, which are 1 in 576 and so 1 in 2 cases. Mario Lemieux. I can see why these are $40 per box. Not a whole lot doing if you don't pull a big parallel Young Guns, but thousands are 1 in 72 Two, so four per case. There they are right there. Also got two pink. They are two per case. So there's the pink. Got plenty of 607 retros. There's all the base for the 607 retros. Didn't get exclusives for the 607, which is possible, but there's all those. And then here's 12 of the 607 retro young guns. Perfetti, Pinto, Newhook, Zegris, McTavish, Holt, Cider, York, Jarvis, Swayman, Podkolzin, and Paterka. So there's 12 out of 25 for the set there for the 607 retros. The tribute young guns there. And then we got one of the highlights of the product. We got the canvases here. A lot of this 
standard upper deck canvas here. Uh, these are quite nice, but we did get some very nice canvases here at the end here, including Brandon Tanner and the Linus Allmark with Jeremy Spaman doing the hug Sally. So two unsuspectingly decent canvases right there. This card sells quite well, which is quite surprising. This card sells too, so two good canvases there. We got three mascot canvases for the collection. We got Chance, Stinger, and Iceberg. So Golden Knights, Jackets, and Pens for the mascots. And we got six base canvas young guns. No side, it still did quite well. There's Baron, there's a Jarvis, Nico Dodds, Gabriel Fortier, and Noonan, and Alex Holt. So actually did quite well. Minus not getting cider. Quite a few very decent names in there. So did pretty decent on the canvas young guns. And we got four canvas blacks. We got Granlin, Hartman, and two young guns, which is nice. Sokolov and Cole Schwinn. So we got eight total canvas young guns. Here's the French, which fall one per box. Here's the base French. There you go. We got three French young guns. Sean Day, Adam Beckman, and Mason Shaw. So these are one in 120. We kind of beat the odds there for those. We got two suit variations of Flurry and not really a suit, but it's the image variation of Jordan Everly throwing a football. So there's that. Got our four clear cuts of the case. We got Duncan Keith, Brad Richardson, Cal Clutterbuck, who, yes, I know, played on Minnesota. I just completely forgot he's been on Islanders for so long. Janssen Fialbi, clear cut young guns. So could have did better with the clear cuts. Kind of hoping to get a clear cut exclusives there, but Janssen Fialbi is not the worst to get for the young guns. So not too bad. And we did get exclusives box 12 of Martin Jones. So nice and exclusive. We also got a UD canvas printing plate of Sean Monahan. So all in all, $40 can't go wrong. That was a fun break. Honestly, wasn't really expecting a lot. I was kind of hoping for a larger card towards the end there, but in general, that was definitely worth it. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do next. I mean, OPG got delayed, so I'm going to have to figure something out for content <laughs> running out. So might be time to restock, even though I was planning on doing a series with OPG, but I guess I'll have to figure out something else in the meantime. So yeah, guys, there's a case of extended. Stay tuned for more breaks to come. As always, thanks for watching. See you guys later.